Yeah, good morning. We are now still on the a sample problem 16.5 item number 2. And sa number 2 natin, there is a table uh, with the data, okay, body A, body B, body C. Okay. Body A, the data okay, contains 1.5 kg daw. Okay, so there's a Uh, by the way, there is a system here. Okay, meron itong system and then there are three bodies uh, inside the system. And again, the, first, the body A contains 1.5 uh, kg with 2.0 meters per second velocity going to the east. Okay. The body B, it has 2.0 kg moving with a velocity of 3.0 meters per second moving to the west. Okay, body C also moves to the west with 2.5 meters per second with a way, uh, with a mass of 5.2 kilograms. Okay, so the question is what is the momentum of the system? There are three bodies and then it is acting as a whole system, whole system siya, but there are three bodies moving in a different okay, direction okay, with a different velocity and with a different masses. So what is the momentum of the system? We know that like on the Cartesian plane, okay, there are x-axis, y-axis. We know x-axis, the horizontal, the y-axis, the vertical. So moving here to the right is positive integers. Moving to the left is negative integers. Same goes with the y-axis. Moving up is positive integers. Moving down is negative integers. So it's like north, south, uh, west, east, right? So let's have first the equation of the momentum which is p is equal to mv so we just need to add all the uh, momentum of this and then we could have the total momentum of the system so the mass is 1.5 kilograms multiplied by 2.0 uh, meters per second and for the body b we have Uh, 2.0 kilogram multiplied by its velocity the 3.0 meters per second and for the body C we have 5.2 kilograms okay, multiplied by the velocity 2.5 meters per second so we will have the answers uh, 1.5 okay, times 2 Which that is 3.0 uh, kilogram meters per second. And all, and we know that body A is moving to the east. Okay. So we have here a 2.0 kilogram. Okay, times 3. We know that is 6. So 6.0 kilogram uh, meters per second. Okay, to the west. Okay, and for the body C, 5.2 times 2.5, we have 13.0 okay, kilogram uh, go, moving to the west. So basically, uh, pwede natin uh, masabi na this direction east okay, and west-west. Okay, we know that east, right? Num right integer as the right going right the east is positive this one is negative this one is negative east positive integers west negative integers okay so if we add all this okay we will have an answer of uh, 13 plus 6 a uh, negative 6 plus negative 13 is uh, negative 19 negative 19 then positive 3 So, ibabawas natin siya kasi positive 3 siya eh. So, ito negative 19. So, negative naging minus 3. That would give us a negative 16. Okay, negative 16.0 kilogram meters per second. So, this negative indicates that the moment, the direction of the momentum of the system is going to the West. Okay, sir, bakit in our textbook, it's positive. Okay, if we just, ang ginawa kasi is, uh, ginawang negative this one, okay, and then ginawang positive this one. But look, 
makikita natin, okay, ito yung nangyari sa book natin, no? ito yung ginawang negative. Okay, ginawang negative, okay, maybe uh, for, the for the convenience, okay, siya yung mas, siya yung mas, na, siya yung mas nag-iisa, okay, na value going to that right side. So, ginawa lang siya negative, para mas less yung, uh, anyway, same pa rin naman, uh, slag yun siya ng direction, no, east, then, uh, west, West. Okay. So, may kita natin, naging 16, naging positive. 16.0 kilogrammeter, but with the with indication of the direction. West. Okay. So, uh, that would not be a problem. Okay. At, at ang importante is may direction siya na na-indicate. Okay. And 16.0 kilogrammeters per second. So, that's it. Thank you so much.